Welcome to my Taka's channel. Today's theme is Akita. Akita is located in the northern part of Japan. The population is about 900,000 people. In winter, northern part of Japan is very cold compared to Tokyo. And the day one after I finished working, I went to Haneda Airport and I took the airplane. My airplane is the, I think maybe that was the latest model. It took maybe one hour from Tokyo to Akita. After I arrived at uh, Akita, I went to a restaurant which, uh, which is specialized in uh, Akiri Temple. And Akiri Temple is one of the best, most famous Akita cuisine. Japanese sake is also famous in Akita, so this restaurant has a lot of Japanese sake and I have three types of Japanese sake. And this is mm, Kiri Temple. Before cooked like this and after cooked like this. Yeah, taste is very good. Day two, I went to Kakunodate City uh, to see the one of the famous uh, Japanese snow rhyme. I mean the uh, snow on the trees. After I arrived at Kakunodate Station, uh, I transit to local line. And which is called uh, as uh, Akita Jukan Tetsudo. It was very cold. The view from train is very good and uh, inside of the train the decoration is also nice and uh, yeah very clean actually maybe actually the train has uh, uh, two cars and uh, mine was maybe new one and uh, another one is old type the tunnel view was also very good Next, our destination is Aniai Station. After I arrived at uh, Aniai Station, I took a taxi and uh, uh, after I arrived at the uh, mountain, uh, I took the rift. And this mountain name is Moriyoshi Mountain, Moriyoshiyama in Japanese. And uh, this is the, uh, one of the most famous snow rhymes in Japan. Yeah, and there are lots of snow rhymes, and uh, it was, it is very beautiful. And in winter, it is very cold here, so you should wear a lot of clothes. This is the day two hotel. This hotel is located in near the Kakunodate station. Day 3 In the morning, I went to uh, Samurai Residence area uh, It is um, also a very famous place in Akita for sightseeing and 
there are some of the Rasamai residents, maybe three or four, and uh, uh, if you pay the fee to enter the samurai residence, then you can, of course, you can go to enter. And if you go to every samurai residence, maybe you can feel the each rank of the samurai residence. This residence is actually very big, so I'm wondering how many how many people lived in here. This is garden. After that, I went to a Japanese primary school, which is already closed in 1974. You can feel very nostalgic atmosphere here. Actually, it was amazing. They keep, they still keep the this school you know, like this uh, condition. This is Day 3's hotel. Day 4. I had a breakfast in the hotel and uh, I went to Nyuto Onsen. Nyuto Onsen is you know, one of the famous onsen hot spring in Akita. And uh, there is a snow dome, yeah. Maybe, uh, I'm sure, but it, it was first time to see like this snow dome. Uh, of course, I don't, I don't take up any photos or uh, videos of the uh, hot spring, so yeah, there is no video and any photos, but uh, the new to onsen, the hot spring was very nice, yeah. If you go to Akita, maybe you should try this onsen. Thank you for watching my Akita vlog. If you like it, please push the thumb up button and uh, please also subscribe my YouTube channel. Bye bye!